This is the Yolen YWS20 display and the remote. I'm gonna go over the various features of the remote and display along with the advanced settings menu. This display is found on my V Freedom City Rang 4.0 e-bike. So let's get started on the different features and settings of this display. To turn the display on, simply press the power button and the display will turn on. To increase the pedal assist mode, you'll hit the plus button. To decrease it, you'll hit the minus button. If I press the I button, it'll cycle through the different display options at the bottom. It starts out at the trip, then the odometer, that's the total miles or kilometers on the bike. One more time, you'll hit the button, it goes to max speed, then the average speed, then the amps. This is the instantaneous amps when you're on the throttle. You can see it jumps up to about 20 amps while riding it. And then if you hit the button one more time, it brings you back to the trip menu. Now, if you hold the minus button or where it has the little foot, it will go into what is walk mode, which is about two or three miles per hour. And you just simply hold that button for about two seconds and you'll see that it engages that walk mode. You can see the little icon right there for the walk mode. And then if you let go of the button, it stops the walk mode. It helps when you're loading the bike or if you need to walk the bike and need assistance. To access the advanced settings menu on this display, simply hold the plus and minus button for about two seconds. It will drop you into the advanced settings menu. Now there's a few different P settings here. I'll show you how to change those. P01, this is for miles per hour or kilometers. Right now it's set to miles per hour. If I wanna change that, I'll hit the I button that's on the left. That drops the number blinking down here. And then if I hit the plus button or minus button, you'll see that it changes it to zero, zero. It's now set to kilometers per hour. Now to move on to the next settings, I'm gonna hit the I button one more time. That's on the left, that brings me up to the top. And then I'm gonna to go to P02. This is for the voltage, it's set to 48 volt. I'm gonna leave that as the default. P03, this is the pedal assist modes. I'm gonna leave that from zero to five. You could change it to zero to three if you'd like, but I'm gonna leave it as the default. So P04, this is the outside diameter of the tire. I have it set to the default at 22 inches. Moving on to P05, this is the speed ratio. It's set to one. I tried changing this because this speedometer is a little bit off on the number, and I tried changing it to 02, 03, and it did lower the speed, but it was far more inaccurate than leaving it at 01. Moving on to P06, this is the speed limit. It's set to 51 right now. I've tried changing this and limiting it. I can't get this to work. Let me know in the comments if you can get it to work, but it was set as the default was 32. Moving on to P07, this is the amps. If you want more acceleration or more torque off road, change the amps from the default, which I believe was 17 to 22 amps, or if you want more range, lower the amps to about 15, it'll be a little bit slower acceleration, but you'll get far more range out of the bike. Moving on to P08, this is to run the motor in forward mode. Run F is forward mode. If you change this, it will run the motor in reverse. I'm not sure why you'd wanna use this. P09, I'm not sure what this is. I thought this was to disengage the throttle, but I tried uh, messing with this setting and I couldn't get it to change any of the features on the bike. So I'm not quite sure what that's for. Uh, P10, this is the number of magnets for the pedal assisting. I left it as the default 12. P11, this is the zero start or non-zero start. I couldn't get this to work. This allows you to force you to pedal, but I couldn't get this to work. P12, this is a setting which I have no idea what it is. I couldn't get it to work. I tried changing to zero, zero, and the default is zero, one. There was no change in the bike's ability. P13, this is to restore to the factory default. You're gonna drop down, change the setting to PSD yes, and then you're going to hold the plus button for two seconds and it will reset it to the factory settings. And then P14 says SL10. I have no idea what this is. I tried changing the settings. It didn't make an impact on the bike. 
and then if you hit the plus button one more time it brings you back to the main menu to save those settings what you want to do is hit the gear icon on the right and there it saved the settings you can see it's in kilometers per hour right now so if i go to pedal assist mode five you're gonna see it goes all the way up to says 60 kilometers per hour it doesn't do it only does about 50 kilometers per hour the speedometer is off on this particular bike i tried changing the speed ratio and i couldn't get it to work if you have some updates to these settings please leave it in the comments i hope that you like this video subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching